So we step and throw the left leg up. Again, we're gonna come back the other way. So turning anti-clockwise. So the left hand brings us back here, the right hand on top. And then again, we're gonna go back clockwise. So the right hand takes us back again to Ganesh hands. To start with then, the feet are together and the hands are together. Take care to align the fingers. That will unite the male and female aspects of the body. The first thing we will do is step with the right foot. And as we step, we're going to turn the foot to this position here. So we step and throw the left leg up to land here in the elephant. We're then gonna bring the hands together and go up, forward, back, around, and down. So much like what we did before, we're doing the same movement now on the side. We'll now do the same in this direction. So step with the right, kick, Forward, backward, around and down. And then we're going to sit into the cat, just as we did in the Vandanam. And standing back up in the same way also. Hand. We're going to come back the other way, so turning anti-clockwise. So the left hand brings us back here, the right hand on top. And then again, we're going to go back clockwise. So the right hand takes us back again to Ganesh hands. And rest. Good. So we have three elephant positions. One this way, one this way, and then again this way. Let's try that once more. And then change legs. So just move the legs. Again. And then bring the hands from the ground through the navel forward into horse. And your two hands are like this. Two hands, one fist. So from here through the navel to the front. And that brings us to the end of the kind of preparatory sequence for the form, which is as far as we'll go today. And we're gonna finish off by looking once more at the southern form, the first form, empty hands form. To start with, we'll just do in two directions, and then we'll add the three and four, or third and fourth direction, rather. So the right foot is in the front, let the body be very soft. And just to remind you, in Southern style, the posture is not so emphasized. The posture is more uh, soft. We don't have to work so hard in that sense to find the posture. Let, let the form flow a little, a little more. So the right foot is in front. We keep the eyes straight as we step back and we turn this front foot to here. Then block with the left hand Bring the right hand up, step through, and slap. And then cut to the back. Relax the arms, turn and look. Block with the left hand, step and slap with the right, cut. And for now we come back to the front. Block, slap, cut. Turn and look. Block, slap, cut. Turn and look. Block, slap, Cut, turn and look, block, slap, cut, turn and look. Once more, block, slap, cut, turn and look, block, slap, cut, 
turn and look and rest there so to remind you the block the hand is starting here on the hip coming up and across the body the slap we always step forward when you're going to attack you're naturally going to step forward into the space of your opponent so blocking you stay where you are and then you step forward bring the hand to here so it's bent and slap across the body from high to low the cut then comes back on one line approximately approximately at the height of your neck so it's from high to low and then straight back great see you next time thank you for watching Nalikanam. Yeah.